Weekly Checkup brought to you by Dignity Health Central Coast. Heart arrhythmias, or abnormal heart rhythms, are extremely common in the U.S. Fortunately, at St. John's Regional Medical Center, they can be diagnosed and treated with a minimally invasive electrophysiology study. Dr. Ali Savari explains. Electrophysiology study involves some sort of sedation or anesthesia, and then obtaining a central venous axis, often via the right groin. This is where the big vein called femoral vein comes to the surface near the skin and it goes directly to the heart. This provides access through which they can put a small tube called catheters inside the heart. These catheters have tip electrodes and they can record the electrical activity of the heart. Using these catheters, electrophysiologists at St. John's Regional can find the abnormal cells or the short electrical circuit in the heart causing the arrhythmia. That is the diagnostic step of the electrophysiology study that is often followed by catheter ablation. When we find those abnormal cells, we can cauterize them whether using radiofrequency ablation technique or heating technique, or cryoablation technique, or freezing technique, and we can eliminate those abnormal cells or that short electrical circuit, and with that, cure the arrhythmia. To learn more, visit dignityhealth.org slash Central Coast. Weekly Checkup, brought to you by Dignity Health Central Coast.